In this video, we're going to explore the Avantis Director software. Director runs on either PC or Mac and allows both remote control of your console over a network connection or the ability to edit show files offline. You can connect your computer to a wireless access point. We have another short video explaining how to do this or directly using an ethernet cable to the network port on the back of the console. On the first screen, we can choose to manually type in the Avantis IP address, select the Avantis from a list, or work offline. Before we do this, we're going to choose our USB drive. The USB drive in Director is a folder location that works the same way as putting a USB drive in the console. This can either be a physical USB drive, in which case you select the root folder of the USB, or it can be any other folder on your hard drive. Let's start by working offline. In the next menu, you can choose to recall a show either from the USB drive we selected earlier or from the director internal shows. If you're just beginning to build your show, then learning a template at this point would be a good start. Looking around the screen, in the center, we have the same GUI you see on the console. This is great if you're looking to familiarize yourself with the console without having access to the hardware. Below the main screen, we have the channel encoders. This function can be changed by right-clicking on the encoder. You can choose between gain, pan, send, and the three custom functions you can assign. Below these, we have the fader, mute, paffle, and mix key. Just like on the console, to select a channel, click the naming area for the channel. In the top left, we have the control for swapping between the two screens of Avantis and Director. Moving down the left-hand side, we have the pre, safes, freeze, copy, paste, and reset functions with soft keys 17 to 24 below. On the right hand side we have the fast grab tab which can be heavily customized to suit your mixing style. At the bottom of the right hand side of the screen we have the remainder of the soft keys. Once you've configured and programmed your show it's time to go online.